Hi everyone, the Spider-Man here. Well, I'm going to be feeding one of my dwarf tarantulas today. And this is my Heterophily Viocilla, my dwarf chestnut um, enclosure. So, I'm going to be giving her a waxworm today. Um, she doesn't really eat much. I do put food in there. And within a two or three days, the food is actually still in there. So, she can be fussy at times. Typical female. <laughs> no, I'm only joking. Um, yeah, so let's get a waxworm and uh, let's see if she's on her. So everybody, there you go, that's my HVO Scylla, my dwarf chestnut uh, adult female. Um, because they're a dwarf species, they don't grow very big. Um, she's about a two and a half inch leg span. And uh, like I said, yeah, she's my adult female. So let's try and get a bit of better footage for you guys. Unfortunately everybody, that's probably the best footage I can get on the front I'm afraid because of the uh, webbings in the way and as you can see they do uh they do web up a lot and it was a uh, a fairly soft uh, takedown and like I've said before with wax worms um, I only give these as a treat so probably once every three months because they are very high in fat as well so um, I'll let her continue to eat her meal and um, we have a, another death in the collection. It's uh, one of my white spotted assassin bugs. Uh, as you know everybody, I've got three of them. But unfortunately one has passed away. So everyone, there you go. There's the one that's died. The one just at the bottom there. And you can see the brown spots. The white spots have gone brown I should say. So I've still got two left. And um, I've had these a while. Uh, I've got these... July 2016, as adults anyway. So, you know, I've had them for 14 months or so. So, um, yeah, one has sadly passed away, I'm afraid. So, while I'm here, everybody, let's just uh, remove that assassin bug. So, everyone, I've just put the cork bark on its sides. Let's just take that one out. There we go, everybody. Let's just quickly put the uh, cork bark back. There we go. So ladies and gentlemen, there we go. Another one of my lovely inverts has passed away. And let's just quickly measure this one. It's fairly big. I'd say it's, uh, yep, four centimetre. If you measure it from the actual antennae, it's five. But if you measure it from the eyes, about four centimeters so yeah unfortunately a lot of my inverts are passing away uh, just due to old age there's not really much you can do about it everybody so um i'll be um rehousing my uh, electric blue tarantula tomorrow and so please stay tuned for that video and uh thanks for watching everyone 